Now, Vice President Yem Yoshi Bajo has disclosed that the President Muhammadu Buhari led administration has spent over $2.7 trillion on infrastructure, which he claims is the highest in the history of the country. Yoshi Bajo said this at the National Consultative Forum organized by the National Committee of Buhari Support Groups, which was held at the nation's capital, Abuja. State House correspondent Ayobami Kwashe tells us more. Present in this all are members of the ruling All Progressives Congress who have come together to achieve one goal, the re-election of President Muhammadu Buhari come 2019 presidential election. At the consultative forum, Vice President Yemi Oshibajo shared ideas on why President Buhari deserves a second term, saying when APC was elected, 22 states were owing three to six months salaries and the president insisted his administration would support states to pay salaries. He said the president made good his promise that saved state from insolvency. Going further, he said in the past three years, the Buhari led administration has spent more on infrastructure than at any time in the history of Nigeria. Look at the number of states that were owing salaries despite the amount of money earned. The president insisted that we must assist the states to pay those salaries. He said, and many of us will remember, that look, I have never been a businessman. I've always earned a salary in my life. Yet, I know how painful it is when a person does not get a salary. Well, I'll not allow that to happen. So we supported the states, all the states, to pay their salaries. We, we supported and we did so three times consecutively so that they will be able to pay their salaries. Only Lagos State, I think it was only Lagos State that turned down the loan because they had enough money at the time. We have been earning 60% less than the previous government. Yet, in the past three years, we have spent 2.7 trillion on infrastructure, the highest in the history of the country, the highest. For the national leader of the All Progressives Congress, Bola Tinubu, and the governor of Lagos State, Akiu Miambodi, they allied the integrity of President Muhammad Dubai as a key factor which Nigeria needs to keep improving the nation. And those are the two key leaders that are in promote image of the country, at develop confidence, promote sincerity, and bring investment into our country. It is only with that respect, with confidence and believability that an investor will come and invest in our country. Do everything that is possible in terms of supporting and campaigning this program to let Nigerians understand that there are two parallel lines between growth and then what we stand to offer which is growth and prosperity for this country, and what PDP is trying to come and re-engineer to take us back to the debris of the past that we don't want to ever go back with. So I just want to... With the team of the forum, Nigeria on the right track, the National Committee of Buhari Support Groups will be open to retain the presidential seat for Muhammadu Buhari come February 2019. From the presidential villa, Abuja, Ayobami Kwashe, reporting for Court TV News. Thank you.